Hi guys, so this video is the extreme quiff. I've done quiff videos before, but this one is bigger, there's more volume, it's got more hold, and it's gonna last you all day. So I actually discovered a new technique for the quiff in this video. I was playing around last night, I was running really late for a dinner, and I started to pile loads of different products in, and it actually created this. Um, so I'm gonna show you how I created it, and how you can do it yourself. Now before I get going, I should say, I'm doing loads more on Instagram, I'm gonna be doing loads more sort of like, uh, lookbook bits and kind of putting bits of outfits together. So go across to Instagram and follow me there and also say hello, I'm man for himself. So I'm starting with clean and towel dried hair. This was exactly the hairstyle I had last night. So just washed out of water and dried with a towel. Before I properly get going, I'm prepping the hair with Label M grooming cream. This will just add a bit more thickness to the hair and give it more texture. And then I'm using a medium heat but fast speed on the hair dryer just to work through it and start to dry it off. Next, I wanna create more of that structure of the quiff, so I'm using American Crew Molding Clay. Now, this is where it all started to go a little bit wrong last night. I wanted a matte finish slick back, but you can see, as I'm starting to put the product in, it's got quite a shine, but it does have a high hold to it. From there, I'm just making sure, again, that it goes all the way through the hair. No one wants bits and clumps. It doesn't look cool. So I'm just using a hairdryer, working again that medium heat and the fast speed straight through. So next I'm using a dry shampoo, and last night when I did this, I used this basically just to erase out everything I'd done. But actually in doing that, it gave it more volume, and it really pushed that hair up to create the quiff. Now I spray the dry shampoo right in from root to tip, and you can see my hair is coated white. Now don't worry, we will get rid of that, and you will see that it will build the volume. So I spray it all over, and then I start to work my hands into it, and I can feel instantly that my hair feels thicker, it feels fuller, and it's going big, big, big. So just using my hands, working from back to front, from root to tip, just really working up that quiff style. It's at this point that you stop whenever you want, and I'm gonna stop right now. I've got exactly the style that I want, and the last thing to do is just to secure it all into place. So I'm just using a little bit of hairspray, blasting it all over the surface of the hair, not touching it, and then leaving it. And we are done. This hairstyle isn't for the faint-hearted, it is massive, I'm looking at it now. Um, and I do look a bit like Sideshow Bob from The Simpsons, maybe cousin, um, it is big. But life is too short, life is too short, live it, enjoy it, while you've got hair, make it big and make it small. And also guys, this does wash out, so no one's gonna die, do not worry. Thanks very much for watching guys, please do give the video a big thumbs up, uh, and also, ooh, and also leave me a comment down below. Uh, if you're new to my channel, then please click subscribe. Uh, we're almost at 60,000 subscribers, which is insane. Uh, I really do appreciate you sticking with me throughout this YouTube journey. Um, and also guys, do come across and follow me on, what have I got? Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. I think that's a lot. But I'll see you in my next new video, which will be next Wednesday. Bye-bye. It's the Teen Wolf one that I went wild for. They first prepped the hair with fudge tri blow, and then they used fudge hot head, which is basically a mousse straight into the hair to add loads of volume. Then, using a hair dryer, the hair was dry.